All right, we're getting ready to do cycle leg blast. You can do this on a couch, you can do it at, on an office chair, and we're using an office chair today because we all sit sedentary way too much at work. And so this is, take a break in your cubicle. In this capacity, it fits underneath the desk. In some desks, you will absolutely hit your knees, so perhaps move it back and take a break, um, or just do a little spin, but let's get started. All right, so first we, even at work, a warm up is always recommended just to get our bodies ready to go. Um, so let's do a quick warm up, two minutes. All right, nice and easy spin. Now, this you could do on a conference call. And at this level, you know, you're not gonna run out of breath and you'll be the only one getting in shape during that call, maybe and your friends who are on treadmill desks. But nice and easy spin, low intensity, get your legs going. At home with the family around, maybe watching TV, still important to warm up. So in this nice, easy green zone for one minute, and then we're gonna do a moderate at, um, for another minute before we jump into the workout. We're gonna get pretty intense in this workout. Not everybody wants to get that intense in an office chair, but you can if you want to. All right, so now we're more in a moderate pace, so pick it up a little bit. Now the XE Keeper also works with an office chair or a seating surface. We're using this, keeps it lower if you did want to use it at the office. Or switch up your workouts to just keep it lower on the, on the floor. Nice and moderate, should be able to breathe easily. Nice warm up. Those legs cycling through. All right, five more seconds and then we're into our workout. First, we're gonna enter the temperature of the device so that we can measure our resistance and how, 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 what level of intensity we worked out at. All right, we're gonna start in moderate. Two minutes, we're gonna be in a moderate. You should be able to have a conversation. If you're doing this at your desk, somebody can walk up to you, have a conversation and not be out of breath. You can do this on your couch, at home, with the family, watching TV. I've had it at the airport. <laughs> and on the soccer field. Nice, moderate pace. Not resistance, not too high, not too low. Warm up those quads. Whenever I'm in this seating position working out, I always think about how much I sit every day at a desk. Uh, you know, doing nothing except work. And so this just feels good to get your legs spinning. So after we get through this moderate pace, we're gonna bump up to a more vigorous into our orange category. Um, you're not quite completely out of breath or at your full capacity, but you definitely should feel more of a burn and that you're giving a lot more effort. About 20 more seconds at this moderate pace and then we're gonna bump it up. All right, let's go ahead and crank the resistance up a little bit. Maybe a little more. All right, all right. That pace going a little more. Two. 
two minutes at this, this pace, and then we're going to bump it up to red. This pace can be pretty hard, so, but keep going, keep going. And just ask you, are you pushing yourself enough? If not, crank up the resistance a little more. Ten more seconds to do our second round of Ed and Moderate. I just turned my resistance up, felt like I could go a little harder. The idea is to make the most of your time while you're doing this. All right, we've got 30 more seconds, and then we're going to bump up to the red. You should, we're in vigorous, so you should really feel your quads are engaged, your inner thigh, your calves. They're all going to work out. Something you can do if you want to switch it up, you can bring your calves up a little bit and pull them more toward you, or flex it up. Whichever one feels good and whatever muscle grip you want to work out. All right. Red, let's turn it up even more and really crank it. One minute in the red zone, you can do it. <sighs> Breathe. You should feel this burning in your quads, in your calves. <sighs> Make sure you're breathing. Oh, and your hamstrings. Come on, 20 seconds. All right, three, two, one. All right, I'm back in the moderate zone. Kind of rest and recover. Consider even spinning backwards. Our next zone is going to be in the, the orange zone. Again, that's our zone four. Harder to breathe, getting some muscle fatigue. You can rotate between forward and backwards anytime you want. Now you don't have to use our mobile app if you're doing this outside where we don't have the video. Um, you know, have your phone in here and check email and conference call, whatever works. All right, we're getting ready to go in our moderate zone here. I mean, into our more vigorous zone, so let's go. Don't use all your energy right now. You got to save that for the red. But you should definitely feel a burn. Woo! Not a bad workout for an office chair. <laughs> But you can do this at home on the couch, too. You can crank it up, crank it down, depending on where you're at. You got two minutes at this orange zone is tough. Keep it going. in a minute and then we're going into vigorous 
really vigorous. The red zone at your max. Right now, we're in orange. Nice and okay, hard to breathe. Fifteen seconds. Then we're gonna go into red. If you are in an office chair and you have the capability to keep it up, you know, it might be a good idea to lock it in place. But it's also nice to kind of sit back. All right. All right, we're let's go hard. If you want to engage your core, you can come up and sit. You can add little things to this workout too. Some overhead dumbbells, some curls. For me, I focus on doing each one of these workouts five to six days a week, where I feel like I don't necessarily have to add more to each workout, but you can. All right, one more second. Woo, okay. Back in the moderate zone. Catch your breath. Your yellow zone is like a nice, brisk walk. You can carry on a conversation, not too, too much. Again, rotate between forward and backwards anytime you want. We have resistance in both directions. We keep going. All right, you only got five more minutes left. We can do this. If you're at home or work, we really recommend using XE barefoot. It's just a great experience. Um, but you can use any shoes that you want. Perhaps if you've got some heels on and your lady might want to kick them off, <laughs> but you don't have to. All right, we got 10 seconds and we're going to go into our ma into our orange zone. We're going to pick it up, pick up the pace. Three, two, one. All right, let's tone up the resistance a little. All right, we got two minutes at this level. This just might be the most productive time you ever sit on your butt. That's awesome. You know, they say sitting is you know, the new smoking. And it's not just sitting, it's sitting and doing nothing. And that's where XE can come in and really get you active in those idle moments that you might just be sitting there and have some fun while you're at it. Oh, we love this device. 10 seconds. And then you got one more round of a minute at the moderate. I mean, at the, at zone four. All right, one more minute. You can do it. Make sure you're breathing. I can feel this in my quads. 
and my glutes and my calves. Keep going. Make sure you breathe. All right, we are getting close to really up in this into our red, red zone. It's only going to be one minute. Once we get into red, you shouldn't be able to talk. You should be pushing yourself as hard as you can. And one, here we go. All right, we're in red. One minute. Only one minute. You got two minutes left. One minute hard. Back into yellow zone. Coast at home and start feeling the burn of this all day. Go hard. Make sure you're breathing. Woo! All right. Almost halfway there. 30 more seconds in the red. Push it. Woo! All righty. Come on. 15 seconds. You got it. Almost. 10. Woo! Almost, almost. You can make it. Three, two, one. Woo! All right. Deep breath and moderate. Let's turn, let's turn resistance down. Get into our yellow zone. Ah, kind of coast. All right, can you squeeze that into your day? In a seat where you otherwise might be sitting still. We think you can. And if you can do bursts throughout the day, exercise is accumulative. We don't have to do 45 minutes an hour at a time. We can do bursts throughout the day. And like this at work, it all adds up. And doing something is better than, do, than not doing anything. And this is the start. You can burn some serious calories and tone your muscles. Oh, we're almost done. Three, two, one. And that's it. All right. Let's in input our temperature, right? So we can keep track of our results, monitor our progress over time, save your workouts, right? And keep track of, did you like it? Did you not like it? Where did you do it? How do you feel when you're done? Right? And keep it all in there. Thank you so much. Have a great day. All right, we're getting ready to do cycle leg blast. You can do this on a couch. You can do it at, on an office chair. And we're using an office chair today because we all sit sedentary way too much at work. And so this is take a break in your cubicle. In this capacity, it fits underneath the desk. In some desks, you will absolutely hit your knees. So perhaps move it back and take a break um, or just do a little spin. But let's get started. All right, so first we, even at work, a warm up is always recommended just to get our bodies ready to go. Um, so let's do a quick warm up, two minutes. All right, nice and easy spin. Now, this you could do on a conference call. And at this level, you know, you're not gonna run out of breath and you'll be the only one getting in shape during that call, maybe and your friends who are on treadmill desks. But nice and easy spin, low intensity, get your legs going. At home with the family around, maybe watching TV, it's still important to warm up. So in this nice, easy green zone for one minute, and then we're gonna do a moderate at, um, for another minute before we jump into the workout. We're gonna get pretty intense in this workout. Not everybody wants to get that intense in an office chair, but you can if you want to. All right, so now we're more in a moderate pace, so pick it up a little bit. 